Hello guys, this is Pink Guy Vision back with another video, and we're back on right, Minecraft Story Mode. This is my part two of part one. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe for next time because you know this might be the end. I got Story Mode. Remember, I said three likes this video. I don't really care if you likes. It's all, it's all I want. Um, I don't really know. I'm, I'm triple up one today. I don't right, know. Peace. Hope you like this video. Please like, comment, subscribe. Let's get into the video. Bye. All right. Where we left off, we're in Hadrian's and the old builder's mansion type place. And this looks OP. Got the slabs up here, but you already know we've seen better. Like the um, Order of the Stones place, which is OP. And also seen we've seen the um, before. the Wither Storm. It was crazy. The storm was, you know, with the storm, killed Ruben. Like, I was so mad about that. Hey, Bat. Hey, Batsy. <laughs> Bat. Alright. Let's just explore this Hadrian's castle, I guess. No portal, Atlas. A man forever voyaging by Soren? Soren? Adrian, get this. That's crazy. Look at that armor. Look at that armor. It's sexy. I'm just playing. I'm just playing, guys. Tim's armor that now belongs to Jesse. So, I see you found <laughs> Tim's armor. Gotta say, Jesse, I'm surprised that you try and steal that armor. Considering everyone is calling you the new Tim. Doesn't seem like a very Tim thing to do, does it? <laughs> yes, I've heard the rumors that they're calling you that, and I can definitely see why. People love an underdog story. It's quite the little journey. I'm not scared of you. Why should you be? I'm trying to give you what you want. You can look closer. Go ahead. I assume by now you've heard all about Tim. Repeatedly. Everyone loves him. And why shouldn't they? After all, he's Tim. Yeah, it seems like he really gives them hope. <clears throat> Even better than that. They really believe in him. Tim is an inspiration to them, even when he's not here. One could say he's an inspiration because he's not here. What do you Wait. mean? Is he, it's is so he much fake? It's easier for a legend to stay nice and shiny when it's a fond memory. Easier to control it. But what are you I've saying? I've been watching is... your legend grow, but I worry that with you still in the picture, it could get messy. I've been starting to think it would be best if you made a quiet exit. You don't belong here. These games aren't for you. Tell me something, Hadrian. Do you even have a point when you start talking, or you just hope to find one along the way? Because I'm getting really tired of listening to you blab. Whoa, wow, well, that's just kind of rude, champ. <laughs> haven't you heard that patience is a virtue? No, See, actually, something I you haven't. Should know about the games. No one ever wins unless we want them to. Not even Tim. What? Let that sink in for a moment, eh? Tim's not real, that's why you're saying that. Is Tim even real? I knew you were a smart one, bucko. <laughs> of course he's not real. What? Tim gives them hope. He keeps them playing the games, but no one wins. Ever. Which is why I think it'd be in your best interest to play along. But don't you miss your friends? Your treehouse? How does he know that? My treehouse? The Atlas can see where people are from, you know. So I had Mevia go check it out. Turns out you're pretty famous. I was impressed. How to bring back some things you might be interested in. <laughs> How does he even do that? That's OP. Axel! Axel Olivia! Olivia. Oh hey, my gosh! Lady. Oh my gosh, I can't believe you're here. Yeah, this really scary lady showed up and knocked us out. Now we're in these smelly boxes. What's going on here? And that guy's voice is the worst. I can even hear it through the obsidian. I'm gonna get <laughs> you guys free, I promise. It's great to hear that you're not a prisoner, at least. Well, I kind of am. Different. Oh. I'm just glad we're all back together. Wait until I tell the others you're here. I've missed you guys so much. Wow. This is just... Wow. Such a 
tapestry of human trauma and emotion. And we haven't even gotten to the best part. What's I the best say part? That for last. What? Oh, yes. Your best friend. Who? Ruby. Ruby. What? Uh, <sighs> heard all about him. Your best friend. Your partner in crime. Oh, it was that guy from Endercon that was afraid of chickens. I told you, bro. Look, my name is Ruben, but the Ruben you're thinking of, he was like a little piggy. <laughs> no, seriously, dude. Big fat. So you used the atlas to kidnap my friends and <coughs> die. Why? Yeah, incentive, Jesse. Incentive. See, even if you win, and that's a mighty big if, they will be staying to work in the mines forever. Or until they get a shot at competing, which is still basically forever. No! Okay, so what's your deal? If you lose the next match and go work in my mines, then I'll let your friends go. All of them. You'll just have to stay behind in their place. I hear it's terrible in those mines. But aren't your friends worth it? I don't believe it. You're just a dirty cheater. You know that I'm gonna win, so you're just trying to stack the deck however you can. You wound me, Jesse. Your barbed words. Ouch. Okay, I had hoped that watching your sad reunion would be entertaining, but I'm done now. What do you say, sport? Your freedom for theirs, huh? Do you think you're worth more than all of them you have a deal jesse hey there we go sport we, we have to do well, this because i don't want to lose our friends this. i think we're all winners here but just to be sure you don't <laughs> try and renege on me we'll keep your friends nice and safe in here remember they're counting on you slab be a pal and give our new friend a walk home sure thing come on squishy <laughs> No, my friends. Jesse, you're okay. What happened up there? Have you seen what Ivor is wearing? I said, <laughs> shut up. Hadrian has Axel and Olivia. What? what? He used the Atlas to snatch them from our world. No. Are they okay? Other than Hadrian having them trapped in obsidian prisons. But he offered me a deal. He said he'll send you all home if I lose and go to the mines in your place. You didn't take it, right? Oh, dear. No! Why would you do that? Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my. I'd have never let you do this. I did it to save you guys. That's what this has all been about. But you'll be trapped. Probably forever. And he'll have the Redstone Heart. Yeah, but at least I know you guys will be free. That's ridiculous. There's no way Hadrian will actually send your friends home. He'll wait till you lose and then send you all to the mines anyway. Probably, while claiming that was the original deal. So who's supposed to help us then? Hadrian and Mevia are both clearly the worst. But what about the third guy? <coughs> Otto? How could he help? He's always stayed out of the more yeah, lever pulling he, sides of the game. He is a he seems like for a rules. big fan of the rules. Maybe we can use that to our advantage. <laughs> he loves rules, that's for sure. Always plays by him. If you won, I know he would definitely make sure you got that atlas. That was the original deal. And he's an honorable man. We're gonna end these games for good. Think you can handle that, Harper? Oh, I think I've got some <laughs> ideas. Wait, wait, wait. You really think you can free everyone in this place and win the games? Yeah. Good luck with that last part. Do you really think you can just beat all the other teams by yourself? Oh, shh, shh, shh. That is a pretty tall order. Even for you, Jesse. Oh, it's impossible is what it is. The old builders expect us all to fight each other. I don't intend to give them the satisfaction. <laughs> You're what? Gonna convince everyone to work together? Oh, you yeah. have to. Whoa. Looks like we've got a little bit of an audience here. Everyone's staring at me. I think that's your I'm the next. Your thing. Let's go. The 
The old builders make you all compete in the games. Event after event after event. They build up hope, but they're still controlling everything. They'll never really let anyone win unless we work together. Hadrian keeps twisting and changing the rules. I say it's our time to change the rules on them. What's the point? Hadrian will still have all the power. There's no way he's gonna let us just take that from him. Because it's not a new rule. The point is... Shut up and let me talk. Shut up and let me talk, okay? Oh, snap. Well, fine. I'll hear you out, but... Nobody beats Hadrian at his own games. Nobody. Hey, Tim did! That's the only thing keeping me going in here. Actually, Tim's not real. <gasps> That's... Uh, no way. Of course Tim's real. Look at the banners. Are you sure? Yeah, Hadrian's real. <gasps> I knew it. All of that stuff about him seems so implausible. So wait, Tim's made up. They just invented him. What a highly elaborate fabrication. Of course he is. It's all a part of how the old builders keep their control over everyone. That's awful. Seriously. But we can beat them. The old builders already controlled everything else. Of course they control the games. Why should I even try anymore? Sitting in their stupid tower, pulling all the levers. Like they got us all on leashes. Hey, but the old builders don't know that we know. We have surprise on our side. Surprise, awesome. That'll be a ton of help when a gladiator's running at me with an enchanted sword. Yeah, I mean, like your plan to take down the old builders sounds cool and all, but um, those gladiators are like super tough. <laughs> like max level scariness, okay? Boo! Oh no, no, I mean totally OP. It's true, any one of those gladiators could probably <coughs> any of us to a pulp one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, where's Jesse going with this? There's no way they'd be able to do that if we all tried to fight them at once. Oh, I get it now. If we work together <coughs> as a team. Okay, now just bring it home, Jesse. You can do it. Doing awesome. We can do this. We don't need Tim because we are Tim. Yeah! <laughs> <Not real. laughs> I can't believe it. Look, it was a nice speech, but strength doesn't come from speeches. Actions speak louder than words. Can't expect you to just talk your way through this, Jesse. My strength comes from my friends. We're always there for each other. It's true. Jesse never even gave up on me. And I used to be a bad guy. Maybe. Oh, man. Man, some crowd. Think they got That's crazy. Me? We are Wait, Tim. So who are we fighting then? <sighs> Reaction definitely seemed mixed. We're doomed. I don't know how we're gonna pull this off. What? Of course we're gonna pull this off. You're Jesse. Yeah, we can still do this. Well, I guess we'll find out for sure in the morning. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is my privilege, nay, my honor, to be here today, kicking off another wonderful day of the game. That's right, Adrian, and not just any day, but the final day of the game. Are our competitors ready for the final challenge? <laughs> the final challenge, let's oh, get it. The walls. The walls. <clears throat> so, scared? Because it's okay if you are. No one will judge you for it. You can tell me if you were scared. After putting up with your breath this whole walk? Please. This walls thing doesn't scare me at all. <laughs> Still got your sense of humor, huh? Cute. Babia, for those unfamiliar with the walls, you want to walk us through how it's played? Sure thing, Hadrian. Teams start out separated in their own sections, divided by the high inner walls. Each team oh, I played this team before. It's in my kind. Build defenses and craft in their section before the, the walls, walls come down. down. Wait, I only see dirt and gravel in my section. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that going to be a problem? The sections are drawn at random. Whatever, I'll make it work. I'm that awesome. Oh, can't wait. 
Once the walls are down, it's every team for themselves. But is surviving the walls the end, Mevia? No, it is not, Hadrian. Whichever team survives the free-for-all needs to step onto the winner's platform in the center of the arena. Winner takes all! But let's not get ahead of ourselves, because that's only if the would-be winners can defeat... Oh. Gladiators! <laughs> that's right! So all competitors better get to gathering materials, because that clock is ticking! Tick-tock! Well, hopefully it's not all dirt and gravel. Adrian, I can't help but notice that our newcomer Jesse Section has a disproportionate amount of dirt and gravel. Man, I hope this is one of those dirt blocks or something oh, underneath it. Works like it's all part of a plan or a deal. Nope, just dirt. Hilarious. Come on. But we have no weapons. We can't craft anything with this gravel and stuff. Gravel? <laughs> gravel that's worse than dirt. <laughs> At least they gave me a crafting table. Now, if only I actually had anything to craft with. Hey! <laughs> Seems like they're happy you didn't get anything. <laughs> I think they're making fun of you. But just my, you know, professional opinion. Oh, would you go away yeah, bro, already? Go away. Gee, sorry, I, I just thought you wouldn't want to be alone. Oh. No. When you die! Oh, do you know what time it is? Ask me what time it is, Mevia. What time is it, Hadrian? It's time for the walls to come down! Oh, I'm dead. Be Competitors are like wild ocelots, sizing each other up, unmoving, before they go in for the kill. Jesse! Yo! Jess! Ha ha! <laughs> Hang on now, we em got movement. Really? Looks like the gladiator formerly known as Emily is preparing her attack. And Jesse, the newcomer, is just painfully unarmed and unprotected. Jesse. This could get ugly. Okay, do whatever it is you have to do. Whatever you say. Oh, Jesse about to get isn't even to die. trying to defend himself. Here it comes. What's up? The finishing blow. <laughs> Thought I'd try giving that friends thing a shot. It appears Emily has Wow, am I glad that this is how this went down because uh, let me tell you, all I had was dirt and gravel. Gross. Could still come in handy though. This isn't how it was supposed to go. What's going on? I have no idea. Come on, over here. Yeah. Why aren't you all killing each other? Tja, man, I can totally see why you'd be confused. You guys are tired of letting the old builders use you like this? Like, uh, like awesome people? No, like little pieces in their games, doing whatever they say. Don't you see? None of us are the enemy. It's them. They're the enemies. They're behind everything. Oh, my head hurts. Too many perspectives. And it appears that Jesse has decided that deals don't need to be kept. And is trying to convince the gladiators to follow suit. These aren't your games anymore, Hadrian. Uh, uh, these weren't our games? Wow, my urge to destroy is dissipating. Ugh, imbeciles! Slab? Slab! What should we do? Uh, uh, uh. I'm they sure were... that the slaughter will commence soon, right? And join us. Be on our side, join us. We know. are the old builders Face now. <laughs> Not going with them, Slab? In my life, I've done some things I'm not proud of. But I won't work for bosses who use people or manipulate them. That's inconsiderate. But you, 
when I was mean to you, pushed you around, and made you go to the tower with me? You got that I was just doing my job and came anyway so we could be on time. That was real considerate. I will join you, Tiny Jesse. Let's I go! I think it's time for us to finish <coughs> this together! It appears all the competitors are headed towards the victory platform. As stated in our rules, anyone who is not eliminated may step on the victory platform and win the games. It looks like they are going to do this together! together. Right behind you, fearless leader. A two slab. You'll pay for that. This wasn't the deal, Jesse. No! No! And they've done it! The competitors have all stepped onto the platform together, which, by the Builder Game Bylaws, means they are all the winners! Which I'm sure my colleague means to say, we are going to find some way to disqualify them? No, we are not. They all win. No! Fabia, Otto, with me. We're ending this. We had a deal. And you broke it, bucko! We're in agreement! You promised me! And to think we let you compete! You should be ashamed of yourselves manipulating all these people like this! How dare you! This isn't up to you! We control the games! We decide their outcome! Mevia... Shut up, Otto! This run needs to pay for ruining our fun! So you admit the games are rigged, then? <laughs> Sure, okay, sure, fine, whatever. Yeah! yeah. Jesse Jesse the games, games fair and square. He's earned the Atlas. Otto, I would think very carefully about what you're doing. I have. Jesse, with the power vested in me as an officiator of the Builder Games, I am proud to pay... Wait, what? What are you doing? Now it's been fun, really. But I think it's about time we end this. Whoa, this is majorly bogus, dudes. Surrender the redstone heart now. Now. Because uh, <coughs> I will trap you here forever. You heard Otto. The Atlas is mine. Yeah, we're going to talk to Otto about that later. But trust me, the Atlas will never be yours. <laughs> Useless! Well, well. Just when you thought M had your back. Fine, go! I don't need you, coward. <laughs> I didn't mean to Run say away, that. Emily. I'm still with you, Jesse. Thank you. You're gonna need all the help you can get, Jesse. Time to take what is mine. Oh, damn, we're about to get bodied by these dudes. <laughs> what the heck? I'll admit your quick sport, but not quick enough for my axe. Oh, what the? Don't forget my axe, Hadrian! Uh. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? I'm getting bodied! Slab! It was an honor to fight for Slab! Gotta admit, kid, you <coughs> show you got skill, <clears throat> but you're still no we'll match. see about that! I got this, Hadrian! <laughs> Let's go! Had enough, Hadrian? Wait, wait! You're right! This has gone too far! It was just supposed to be a game! You expect me to believe that? Come on, sport. Haven't you ever had anything get away from you before? I mean, can't you... forgive me? <laughs> no! This game... is... No! Oh my gosh, I just got bodied. That's our game, sports fans! The Redstone Heart has been returned to its proper owners! <laughs> I... I lost. Hey, fancy meeting you here. You know, I've sent hundreds of competitors to these respawn pits. Never knew it hurt so much. Sorry, that's probably not helping your mood right now. It's over. I... Oh, I don't think so. It's us. Yeah. I'm so happy to see you guys. I know you said you were done helping me, but I hope you can give me another chance. You know, because I'm awesome. And we both need to get out of this. 
as someone once told me, teamwork makes the dream work. <laughs> so let's get to work. Let's take them down. But I lost my inventory when I respawned. How am I supposed to get the Atlas back without any weapons or armor or anything? Well, we may have made a little stop in Hadrian's inventory room and helped ourselves to a few things. Awesome. Here, buddy. Wow. Take this. Thanks. Hey, suspenders. Over here. Tim's armor. Belongs to you now. Time to kick some old builder. That's butt. OP. Look at that armor. Now to pick a weapon to go with my sweet new armor. Ooh, yeah, nice choice. Bad. Sweet. Payback time. Ah, I'm gonna have that shield up because that shield's OP. What should we do with all those other competitors who betrayed us? Well, Mevia, spending eternity in the quartz mines doesn't seem like punishment enough. <laughs> I have something special in mind for them. Hadrian. Mevia, this game just went into overtime. Let's get it. Well, isn't that cute? You found Tim's armor. I'm going to make you beg me for a deal. Seems unlikely. We don't beg sport. Oh, I'm going to enjoy crushing you. Yeah. <laughs> People is built her OP like. Ah, wall, wall. <laughs> Look how slow I do compared to them. Thanks, Wall. <laughs> there. That should keep me quiet. No one gets out of obsidian. Harper, I'm gonna owe you one. Time to go to work. Ah! <laughs> why am I yelling? I have no idea why. But I guess it's just hype. You man, me a give up. Okay, body. Wow, her inventory was huge. Mavia, come on! What kind of rookie move was that? Ta <laughs> <laughs> ta for now, Bucko. Hey, Hadrian! Huh? Over here! You mess with one member of the Order of the Stone. You mess with all Go, of Jesse! us. Go, Jesse! I Time believe to in shut you. you up. You take this as going to help? You're deluded. Let's take him to the slab land. By uh, I'm I'm still workshopping that one. Shut up. Let's go. <laughs> oh man, I love Let's I love talk I know about this. Hmm, is that begging? Does that sound like begging to you, Petra? It sure does, Jesse. Told you. Shut up. Just shut up. Alia, shut up. I see you don't like having a live audience, Adrian. Come on! Jesse, remember Spleen. Got it. X. Oh my gosh, boy. Oh my gosh. I just crossed that dude. I do, it's inventory. I knew it. You and your stupid deals. There's no time for that now, Mevia. We have to get out of here. Come on. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, guys. How's it going? <laughs> it's going not the best, and you're not going anywhere. Yeah. <coughs> Sweet wants to discuss his benefits plan. Hang on! Jesse, you did it! <laughs> oh, man. Again! Feels like I say that a lot. I couldn't have done anything without all of you. Well done, Jesse. An excellent job. Uh, thanks, Otto. You have truly shown my friends and I the error of our ways. I'm glad to put this whole messy business behind us. Start over. Man, do you need some new friends, you know that? Yes, I have come to that same conclusion, and <laughs> oh, I am man. working on it. 
I also know that the Atlas is not mine to keep. Dang, that is tough. You have barely defeated them. Seems only fair that you get to decide their fate. And with the Atlas, you can send them anywhere you want. Hmm. You know, there was this game that Olivia and I used to play back in our treehouse. Huh? Remember? We called it, Which Would You Rather Fight? Oh, man. Which Would You Rather Fight? See, that was That's episode I mean. one. Let's spread stone heart right out. The whole thing shut down. Man, you guys have had some crazy adventures. So many people trying to kill you. Goodbye, Jesse. Goodbye. Thank you. Is that all of them? Everyone that wants to go home anyhow. Except you folks, that is. I can't believe how many competitors actually want to stay and keep playing the games. Thanks to you, my intrepid new friend, I can actually work on making them fun again. Very exciting. It'll be more challenging just by myself, but a good challenge. That's what I do. Exploring new worlds, helping people wherever I go. I was happy to help. Well, I'm very grateful. What you did won't be forgotten anytime soon. And I'm gonna help too. You taught me a lot about fairness, Jesse. And I'd like to use that new knowledge for something good. Oh, Hello. and speaking of fairness, I think this is yours. Oh, man. There was some good stuff in there. I was really moved. Awesome. Huh. I guess he wasn't so immovable after all. Well, Em, how about you? You said you wanted to go home, right? Yes, I just can't decide if it's what I want. You get to leave and go on more adventures. Do I really want to go back to farming? I mean, it has been ages since I've seen it, and I miss my friends. Sounds like Otto's gonna be, you know, like, restarting the games. You could stick around and help with that. Jesse, yeah, that should be awesome a good idea. idea. Mm -hmm, good idea. Fun! Maybe I can be head gladiator. Yeah. Thanks, Jesse. I needed that. Hey, Ivor. Oh, hello. What you doing? I was just observing Harper. All by herself, over there. She seems lonely. Go think about Harper. <laughs> Come on. Hey, Harper. Oh, hey, Jesse, Ivor. I was just watching folks head on home. Things really worked out, huh? Well, I guess this is goodbye. Truth be told, not really sure what I'm gonna do with myself. Crown Mesa was the closest thing I've had to a home in a long time, and well, clearly they don't want me back. So now I'm kinda, well, without a home. You could always come with us. Yes, that's a lovely idea. Nah, that's real sweet of you and all, but all right, fine. I can't just keep tacking myself on to other people's lives. It's time for me to find my own world, my own home. Try to make up for the not so good things I've done. If my experience is any indication, you'll probably still be haunted by nightmares for a while. Waking terrors, guilt sweats. Don't worry. It'll all pass soon. You are a strange, strange man, Ivor. But you know something? You're okay. Take care of each other, all right? And I'll see you around. Bye, Harper. Yes, goodbye. Come on. You're amazing. <laughs> so... How do we get home now? Well, the Atlas belongs to Jesse now. The deal's a deal and all that. Sweet. Uh, how does it work? Now you just say where you want to go, and the Atlas will show you the way. Why don't you just go ahead and open it? Okay, book. Take us home. 
Whoa! Spectacular! Incredible! Nice. Well, that's uh, well, that's cool. There it is. Home. Figure it's about time we get heading on home, huh? That sounds awesome. Yeah. Home, here we come. Let's go. portals we're home I know I can't believe it either for all that traveling we were doing I was starting to wonder if we'd ever get home <sighs> it is good to be back I'm just so glad we're all back together that atlas is so cool I'm glad Otto let you keep it fabulous yes and that's not all we got seriously what else did you get yeah show him Jesse Oh, what should we put? Pama's redstone heart. I know that Pama was evil and everything, but I still kind of wish I could have seen it. The crown of the Eversource, the magical source of all of Sky City's precious materials. Whoa, wicked! Portal Atlas. I could have lost all the rest so long as we got to keep that. Ha! Huh? I wonder what Soren would have thought of it. So much power contained within such a tiny Whoa. object. Easy there, Ivor. <clears throat> Sorry. The mask of Cassie Rose, aka the, the White, White Pumpkin. Oh man. That's even creepier looking than I imagined. The enchanted flint and steel. The one that started the whole thing. Yeah, none of these other adventures could have happened if it weren't for this. I can't believe you got to do all those incredible things. Makes sense, though. You were gone a long time. Wait till we show you all the improvements we've been making to town. Um, Jesse? What's up, Lucas? So, I've been writing stuff in here, you know? And, well, it's kind of become like a legitimate book. But there's just one problem. I still need to put what happened to you. You've, well, you've been the hero of this whole story. It wouldn't be right to end it without saying what happened to the hero. Let's see, this is a big part, so... Impossible without friends, we all return home safe. Greatest hero ever. And so Eva was vanished. Oh man, well you want people to finish the book feeling really excited, right? So you should do something awesome. Something like, uh, the Order of the Stone returned. Mighty warriors who had vanquished evil from the land. All lands! Okay, it's a little more grandiose than my usual style, but <laughs> I like it. There, done. Oh. Tell the next one, anyway. I was thinking that maybe we could put it in here with the other treasures. I know it's not as cool as, <clears throat> like, a portal atlas. That's a great idea. That's a great idea, That's a great idea boys. Hang on. What is it? Wasn't that where the portal atlas was a minute ago? Yeah, that was definitely where you put it. Guys, Flint and Steel are missing, too. And where's Ivor? Ah, uh, nah. <laughs> oh, man. Is that bad? What should we do? I mean, I guess he you gotta catch up. knows what he's doing. Come on, guys, we have to catch up with him. That's a perfect way to end it. Who did you? Dang, no one rescued Ivor. That's that's kind of sad. 
did you make a deal with M? 64%. Did you save her? A lot of people saved her. Oh, did you make a deal? 50% didn't. Alright guys, if you enjoyed this from uh, Minecraft Story Mode. Oh, what? Zombie Sash Chickens. <laughs> well, in a very unfortunate and unexpected twist, it appears we are in the land of chickens that are indeed the size of zombies. <laughs> That's great. That's right, Adrian. And it looks like we're just gonna have to wing it. <laughs> wings. <laughs> Chicken wings, you know. You're fired, Mavia. You're fired. Alright, that was all the episodes. That that was actually pretty good. Like, I actually enjoyed that series. This is the end of Microsoft Mode Season 1. I will be doing Microsoft Mode Season 2. Like, in probably like two months or so. Because that's a lot of episodes. That's literally five more episodes. And the, and the, and the Microsoft Mode Season 2 episodes are way longer than these episodes right now. So, if you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, subscribe. Uh, let's go for the likes today. Peace. Until next time, on my customer mode. Bye bye.